Max Peretz was born on May 9, 1914, in Vienna, Austria. His father was a textile manufacturer and his mother a teacher. He grew up in a Jewish household. That heritage would later vastly affect his later life. As a child, he was a student at a private institution and that sparked within him an interest in chemistry. He attended Vienna University to study chemistry with the support of his family. Vienna University gave him his first degree. Because of his Jewish heritage, his family's business was disentitled and his family became refugees. He was deported to Canada by British officials after the Nazis invaded Austria during World War II. He worked on many projects for the Allies. He received his Ph.D. from Cambridge University, founded the Medical Research Council Labor Laboratory of Molecular Biology, and went on to earn the Nobel Prize in Chemistry in 1962 for his model of the hemoglobin. Fourteen other scientists on the council also won the Nobel Prize. He also received the Royal Medal of the Royal Society in 1971, the Copley Award in 1979, and he also received Commander of the Order of the British Empire, the Austrian Decoration of Science and Art, and an Order of Merit. Without Max Perutz, the molecular structure of the hemoglobin, discovered by X-ray crystallography, we wouldn't be able to combat blood diseases concerning the hemoglobin properly. He died on February 6, 2002, at the age of 87. He is buried at the Parish of the Ascension burial ground in Cambridge. Five adjectives to describe him are relentless, intellectual, tenacious, influential, and critical. Relentless because he would not give in despite circumstances, including his deportation Intellectual, because of his vast knowledge in biochemistry, due to his very prestigious educations. Tenacious, because he would always persevere. Influential, because of his awards in the science community, most importantly and not notably the Nobel Prize in Chemistry. Critical, because of how tirelessly he worked to perfect the model of the hemoglobin, a very extensive and intricate blood cell.